Hello again. Today I'm going to show you the new way you register hosts with satellite 611 and 612. So first let us hop on to our satellite server. Log on real quick. This server right here is satellite 612. So what we need to do for registration before you just you would have just done it by doing the RPM and installing the Catello client and then registering with your activation key as you've seen in previous videos I've had. Now you come into host and go to register host and you have a number of options you can pick. So you have your organization, location, you can choose your operating system which it says you only need to do that if subscription manager is um, not installed. Uh, we have that on our server so I'm going to leave that part blank. We do not have any capsules so there's nothing to pick here. The main thing we need to pick is our activation key because that's required. We're going to register a RHEL 7 server in our dev environment so we're going to pick that. You can also spe specify your lifecycle environment. You can also um, install certain packages, you can update packages, um, you can set up repositories, GPG keys, and also your token lifetime. So we're going to leave everything as it is. Everything looks good for our Rails 7 registration. And we're going to hit generate. It creates this curl command that we need to run. So we're going to copy this in the clipboard and then switch over and log on to our server. So we're going to go ssh root at rel 7home the root user.com left out the L. There we go. Now we're on. So now all we have to do is paste our curl command and run it. It's going to run through a script that's going to do a number of things. It's going to register the server. It's going to then install some packages, insights, register insights as well. So let's um, just sit here and wait for it to finish doing its thing. Okay, we see where it says automatic scheduling for insights to be enabled and it's starting to collect insights data for this particular server. Okay, the server is now registered. Subscription manager identity. And there we go, we are in dev with the content view of rail seven. The org ID is the root user, org name is the root user. So if we switch back to our server here, we can go into content hosts. And we see our Rails 7 server right here. It is completely up to date at the moment, so it requires no patches. And that pretty much is it in a nutshell. Um, that is the new procedure for registering hosts to a satellite 611 and 612 system. Hope you found this information helpful. And until next time, have a great day, everybody. Bye.